Hey everyone, and welcome to World Heritage Journey, where today we're at the Bielowieza Forest in eastern Poland and Belarus. Bielowieza is a primeval, old-growth forest, and it's the last remaining fragment of a forest that once covered almost all of northern and central Europe. It's primarily comprised of ash, pine, spruce, fir and oak trees, and it's home to some 12,000 different species, including one very, very special one. Let's check it out. So when I say this is old growth forest, this is what I'm talking about. This oak tree behind me is estimated at around 450 years old. Now sadly, this one is nearing the end of its lifespan and it will come down in the not too distant future. But that's not the end of the story because old growth forest means that the trees fall over and then they just lie there as dead trunks but they make an excellent habitat for thousands of different species. And it's estimated that of the 12,000 species that live in the forest here, about half of them depend on fallen trees to survive. The forest is home to many different species of large animal, including horses, boar, deer, moose, and many others, including most notably the European bison that you can see behind me. Now it's an animal that has a tragic history because it was heavily hunted for its meat and for its skin, just like in the Americas. And in 1919, German soldiers shot and killed the last one in Europe. And it was estimated that there were only 50 animals left worldwide. The new Polish government in 1923 purchased four animals and set up a breeding program right here in the forest. And by 1929, the population had rebounded to 16 animals and it's continued to grow over the years. These days, it's estimated there's about 500 animals worldwide and about 30% of them are here in the forest. This site has been the subject of massive controversy over the past few years because in 2016 the Polish government tripled the amount of trees that could be logged from within the national park, not necessarily within the World Heritage Area. The Polish government said that it was necessary to combat an infestation of beetles, while the European Commission, Greenpeace and UNESCO all disagreed, saying that the logging was very damaging to the ecosystem. They took them to court and won, but as far as I'm aware, the logging is still continuing. This has been a fascinating World Heritage Site, I think, because there's some really interesting history here and it's beautiful nature as well. Even though it's old growth forest and say not as attractive as something like rainforest, I've found it really, really interesting. And seeing the bison, they're just magnificent animals and that was really cool. But that's it from me. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. I'm Joel on the road and I'll see you at the next World Heritage Site.